Hello and welcome to the video. I am the Cosmic Turtle and today we will not be standing again. We will be continuing the playthrough for the Outer Worlds on Supernova difficulty. So for some reason I was on Twitch for too long and my game got sent back to the main menu. Very strange, didn't know that could happen. And if you didn't, now you do. Small world, strange world as well though. So just quickly load this up and get into it as soon as we can. Just need to make sure everything on Twitch is as it should be. You know the drill by now if you've watched more than one of my videos. Won't be but a moment sorting that out. Need to put my phone on to charge. In addition. Right, we've got a skill point. We won't, we won't assign the skill point just yet. We'll wait until, I don't know, we need some extra skill points and then we'll do it. So let's click on this little image of myself here. We're going to click this little pencil here. It says the Outer Worlds. It's a little bit difficult. Yes, yes. Right, okay. That is, that's all correct. Let's make sure my voice is being picked up. Give that a second before I can. Right, we'll, we'll progress a little bit. Here Your before. face is a site for sore ocular processors, Cap. Yeah, it probably is, isn't it? Right, so we've got a fast travel. Ah, we're going to Terra 2. We're going here to the board's main uh, hangout. We are now in orbit above Byzantium, Captain. Fantastic. Thank you, my. Fantastic machine. Always there for me. Let's have a look. Can everybody hear me? Yeah, alright. My voice is being picked up. So yeah, I have. Uh, I, I was too lazy uh, this morning and last night, but I haven't checked, like I mentioned in the last stream, I would to see if it lagged in the last video. But I'm not sure if it's just the weather getting really bad or if Sky is slacking. But for some reason, the bitrate recommendation for my streams has gone down by about a thousand since the last time I. Uh, where the hell am I going? Since the last time I sorted it out, you know, I we go. Because obviously I put it on recommended and I drop it by a tiny bit just to be safe. But it's over a thousand lower than it was the last time I did that. The only thing I'm thinking is it might have been back when I, I used to live in Cardiff. So I, I might have done that last before I moved to a new place and got a new internet provider and everything. So I'm not sure, but I don't think so. I f I'm pretty sure... I've just Friend. received a report of your work on Monarch. Pretty sure I've done the it since I moved. Have been silenced at last. They have. Unfortunately, Sanjay and broadcasts Graham Bryan still draw breath. I would have liked to be rid of them, but they're no longer important. And you broke it in alliance with the broker himself. Hiram Blythe is a valuable asset. Well done. Your well, work you. is exemplary. You've earned a place in the chairman's inner circle. I have, haven't I? Are in order. Seventy-two thousand experience. Goodness me! I need that kind of experience. Um, what happens now, now? We introduce you to the chairman's plan. Turn your eyes to the screen. Will do. Good afternoon. Right then. I'm Chairman Rockwell. Good afternoon. And I'm here to address a serious issue facing us. As you all know, our colony has been successful beyond our wildest dreams. Unfortunately, this is true, we've recently discovered that our food supply will not be able to sustain Halcyon's population in the long term. Everyone will die. Everyone <laughs> will slowly stop living from malnutrition. 
But we're doing it together, and that's what matters. I fucking swear, if someone doesn't give me something to read <laughs> that will placate the masses soon, all of you will find yourselves violently unemployed. Violently unemployed. <laughs> but I can assure you there's nothing to fear. We've got a solution. It's called the Lifetime Employment Program. We will freeze most of the colony to preserve resources, while the best and brightest of Byzantium continue living in prosperity. Look, you idiots! How many times do I have to tell you we can't say shit like that? Fire whoever wrote this! <laughs> while Halcyon's brightest minds solve the problem of our nutritional shortage, the rest of the colony will be placed in suspended animation. Individuals will be revived on a rotating basis, so that every Halcyonite can be part of the important work of saving our colony. By testing paperweights. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> couldn't resist. Let, let's go again. And someday, in the not too distant future, when we've solved this crisis, <laughs> we'll all be back together again, working for the good of Halcyon. Until then, the board shall provide for the deserving just as it always has. So. Obey your supervisors, take your vitamins, follow your corporate mandated grooming rituals, and sure thing, Hulk Hogan, I'll take my side, vitamins. There is nothing to worry about. Halcyon. Halcyon yeah. is on the verge of a total systems collapse. The truth oh, well, is ugly good, is and it? difficult to accept, but we must accept the truth before we can move forward. Malnutrition yeah. is already uh, a problem. I like Disease like will come next, followed by starvation, on life, I suppose. followed by a breakdown of society, followed by extinction. I know this must extinction. come as a surprise to Goodness you. me, that's a bit extreme. You have questions. Of an outcome, but it makes sense. Just tell me what you what you need done. Need to talk yeah, about that was a sentence, wasn't it? I will be frank. Edgewater was a lost cause. I never expected yep. the settlement to survive another year. But then, you came along. I don't know how you managed right. to convince a faction of disloyal workers to return to their posts. In fact, Edgewater is more productive than ever before. Oh, Every oh hell, thank you. Edgewater will be expedited yep. into our lifetime employment program. Well done, Captain. That town owes you an enormous debt. I'm glad I could help them. Dumb. I don't know what expedited means. <laughs> Edgewater's workers have proven themselves valuable. When the time comes to Oh, she doesn't even like mock me, which I thought she would. They're going to be the first in line. You should be proud of yourself, Captain. You're on the verge of making history. Oh, I got an achievement. There's just one last job. Mightier than finish. the sword. Saved Edgewater permanently. Huh. I didn't know that was an achievement. Ship, reactivate its navigation system. I finished a weekly challenge. The colony ship into orbit around Tartarus. Once the hope is in position, we will have everything we need to begin healing the colony. All right. I have the All right, I'll do it. In your abilities, Captain. You, you can now travel to the hope to from your ship. Halcyon together. Oh, what's going on? Oh shit! I'm. I at least I drowned into death. Then I I'm very thirsty. Damn. Glasses and... Uh, what's this? Press an X. I'm trying to add it to junk. Alright, uh, apparently some liqueur does not quench your first. Sorry, gla I got a headset on and glasses and it's making my hair go all over the place. I'm like a male Medusa over here. Alright, there we go. That's better. So, I've lost some perception and charm. And dexterity. Oh no, hangover dexterity. Oh well. Um, where's just an ordinary drink? That's wine also. What's this? Dehydrated water tablets. Do they work? Yeah, they do. Not as well, but they do. They're making my water go down. Interesting. There we go. That's making my water go up. Energy drink. There we go. This will get. This will get results. The results we want.
Alright then. We gotta go back to our ship. Ship. Alright, yeah, okay. We've gone the right way. This place confuses me. Oh my god, look at all those things. I got all sorts of buffs going on there by my health bar. Right, well, since we've done that, we probably should save the game here, just in case. Tell you what, I'd cry if I accidentally saved over my level 29 save. I'm so close to being level 30, i got no quests I can do, so I can't get big buffs of experience. I've literally just spent my time running around the ho oh, there's the hope. Running around to all of the different colonies. Killing every innocent person I can find just to get the experience out of their corpses. That's the that, that's the stage I'm at with. All right, I can do that. Um, what's going to happen if I if skip the hope? your calculations are even slightly off, you could crash the entire colony ship into Terra too, or the sun. The sun? Well, that wouldn't be very good. Um, alright, that's it for now, let's do this. Are we going to save the game by here? Because I am going to try and skip the ship into the sun. Since I'm pretty sure there's an achievement for doing that, and it'll be funny. Let's be fair here. Mainly the second one. What is it? I am known to be a bit of an achievement whore at times, and I really enjoyed playing this game through the first time. This, to be fair, my second time while streaming it has been really fun as well. It's just the difficulty can be a bit of a ball ache at times. Especially when I forget to repair my weapons or equip stronger ones. But it's a great game. Definitely worth buying or getting the Xbox Game Pass. I'm playing it through the Game Pass. What's this? We've got two objects. But I will get it as uh, what's it called a physical copy, probably when it goes down in price. I haven't looked. It probably, possibly, already has gone down in price. Keep secret, but not forgotten. Uh, status. What is power? Can we, can we just click all these thingies. That's what we needed to do there. We've done that. Ah, here we go. Here's a workbench. Let's repair anything that needs repairing, then, shall we? Uh, repair. Nice. Sure. Let's repair them both. So, this is what I'm wearing. What mods we got? Can we make it look brave enough to make us stronger? Then, well, let's buff up the armor rating. Tech skills, sure. And carrying capacity. Bargain. Uh, assault rifle, heavy assault rifle. So I love this weapon. Ranged weapon spread. Well, it shoots one big. I think it's one shot, but sure. Uh, weapon firing noise, yeah. Why not? There we are, we got some mods. Improved our armor a little bit. Ah! I don't get Welcome attacked by board, you! Captain. Mr. Conde message ahead. I wish hey. this place were in better condition for you, but we're in a bit it's of okay, a son. It's okay, son. It's okay. Seems the damn auto mechanicals think we're intruders. 
Oh no, how many are there? Many. They're all over the rest oh, of the ship. What a crap answer. We shut off the main power, so they're disabled for now. If you go hooking your ship up, I suspect they'll recharge. And that means trigger oh. happy auto mechanicals. I'm not going to I think get I already did that, didn't I? <laughs> I'm also not going to send more Ooh. of my staff to their deaths. Um, if any of the crew are still uh, no, uh, any of the crew still around, maybe I can grab an ID card and play. We tried it. that, didn't work. Something about her face is not matching up. We stored oh. what cards we could find in the badge station to my right, but it's locked off. Can't just hand over whole property. Sorry. I'm doing lunch with Chairman Rockwell after this. I let him know it. <laughs> what? Come on, I'm just following protocol. Ugh. Uh, Fine. I'll have someone unlock the door. But if anyone asks, damn I'll tell right. them you broke in. He said on your right, but I suppose he means the way he's facing, doesn't he? Because this is his right. Who, who the hell did you have open this door? There's no one in here. I picked up and stole it by mistake. Is he gonna try and kill me? Man? No, he's not. Right, okay, my character is definitely a, a woman. Let's just steal everything while crouching like a ninja. Well, except for things we're not gonna use. No point taking what we're not gonna use. What's this? Ah, yeah, there's the ID card. Take this mag pick. Oh, we'll take this. It could be useful. All right. I am disguised right now. Interesting. We're going to try and play this cool. Alright, fall back, fall back. You're too strong. That one got the mustard. Ah, uh, Duncan. Turn on to help me, the swine. Oh god damn. Uh, I think my best bet is not fighting them. What's the time difference? There's like no difference. Alright, we load up this one then. Hmm. I'll check my guns. If I'm lucky, I'll have a shock based weapon that will hopefully do more damage to the robots. Because obviously, I had a plasma weapon there. Really? They couldn't even do a save when I was outside the hope. No, oh, I have to do a second loading screen again. Charging a melee power attack after a right to left alright. While sneaking, indicators in your hub show nearby enemies and their footsteps. No, and yeah, the footsteps become something or other. Stuff, you know. You know how it is. 
shrinking ray. That could that could get the job done. Light. Oh no, it just says energy. Plasma rifle. Flamethrower. Could go for. I do really like the bolter pistol. Okay, well, let's go for. Let's get rid of you. You is useless. Shrink ray. And you is pretty useless as well. Where's that bolter? There we go. Let's let's try these two. This was one of my favourite weapons my first time round, so. And I barely used this. I get the feeling I'm gonna go for a sneaky approach here and just try not to kill anything. Right, we're gonna skip his dialogue this time. Except for when I ask him to let me in the thing. I'm gonna try something other than uh, lie. Yeah, so all we got persuade. Haven't you heard? I was one of the hope passengers. Maybe I've got a card in there. I heard rumors, but I never thought. Hey. So you're what, seventy something years old? Whew. All right. I'll have someone open the door for you. Good luck. Hey, is this still gonna count as stealing now? Yeah. Okay. Still counts as stealing, despite the fact he gave me genuine permission this time. I believe that's everything except for this. That's a fair point though. My character, in theory, there's no reason to assume that they wouldn't have permission. What was this? Cigarettes. I will pick this lock just for the experience. What we got here then? Let's see what we can buff up for ourselves. My lock picking is all the way down for some reason. Let's put that up there, so we got that. We got some in here. And put one in sneak. Yep, I'm happy with these. I think my skills are all down because of the alcohol that my character drank. Okay, we're going to try a non-violent approach this time, or if we do have to engage with violence. I'll use my shrink ray, which will hopefully Remember, be more useful than I think it's going to be. cloaking device. Oh no, but isn't the cloaking device this disguise thing I got going on here? Oh way. Alright, one stopped. Processing. Breach. Yeah, that does almost no damage. What the hell is, what could this act? Oh, that's good. That's good. If I don't get myself killed, this gun might get the job done. Ah! No, not now! <laughs> P 
Peeps! You gotta save me! They don't care! I could be your... Ah! Run! Oh, thank god, someone is shooting at them now. I'm done. I think they killed Duncan. Why is this doing so little damage? What's going on here? Oh, it's got the repair symbol next to it. Shit. Let me guess, I can't repair while in combat? Oh, I can. Haha! <laughs> right, repair all. Person. All right, there's one of them dead. A medical droid as a gun. That's right, so my last healing. I didn't realize how, how little damage my other guns were doing to realize that this was actually doing decent damage. Ha <laughs> ha! Clear what that was. Ha <laughs> ha! All right. Plasma weakness. Getting burned too many times. No, I. I cannot accept any. I got two heals. Plasma rifle 2.0, yes, please. Well, I don't get why they decided death was a uh, preferable choice to fighting back. For some reason, everyone is dead, and none of them chose to shoot back. They all just accepted that their life was over, basically. Very strange. On the plus side though, we did gain some better guns. Well, we already had a 2.0. Plasma Carbine is what we're using now. 200s. Right. Have to change guns before we can swap it. 
Oh, this is a higher level and does more damage, so in theory this might be better. <sighs> if there are too many enemies, I'm going to have to go back in to my ship to save. You know, I've got a skill now where I get 15% I'm very annoyed by that I did not know that that shot out a giant blast I also did not know that I would hurt myself with that gun. And I certainly didn't know I'd do that much fucking damage, because I was ridiculous. <sighs> well, this alleviates my fears of this taking too uh, this being too quick and I end up finishing the game in five minutes. Not literally five, because it was eight minutes before I got here the first time. <sighs> Alright. Well, I'm going to try and just... This is a throwaway attempt. I'm just going to try and run past everything and see if that works. But they said if I don't connect my ship, then nothing will turn on. So let's check. He lied. System. And I didn't connect my ship, yet they're all active. Exact same thing as last time. Except now there's a third one. Oh, there's four of them this time. Alright, oh, okay, but some of them are nearly dead already. Alright, we've got some health back. Stay in here. Ah, I fucked it. that bolt cutter two I had. Uh, now. 
Hey, that wasn't so hard. And this time they appear to have killed no one. Which, yeah, I suppose that's good. But, oh no, this person was dead before. Cool. Welcome aboard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, uh. I'm sure she has the utmost faith in. Need some? What else do you have? Uh. Let's just ignore that. Alright, let's go. Let's collect all this jargon. Again. I don't like how you can't reload and pick up stuff. I know it's more believable and more realistic, don't get me wrong. It doesn't make it any less of a pain though. Can't open this guy. No. My skill's even lower now. I guess I did it quicker this time before the alcohol wore off. There's two more that I wanted to give, but there we go. So we got our. Uh... There we go. There we go. All right, we're gonna. Oh, we've got a ladder here. We'll see what's up that ladder now. We'll quickly connect this, since clearly, you know, leaving it alone. Hey, there's the plasma rifle. Clearly, leave, you know, leaving this inactive was a lie. It did not help me in any way. A new perk and skill. This is, as they say, greatly appreciated. Taking a lot. I think I'll take fall damage if I drop down. I'm up to 11 of the uh, healing thingies now. Right. What, what can we get? Uh, using companion ability when when you critically hit a target, you have a chance of immediately resetting the cooldown of companion ability. No. Consumable weight is down. Base armor rate up by 5. Might go for that. It's got to be this, hasn't it? But I'm in a party on my own. I could have been doing a quarter more damage. But you know, no matter how you look at it, 25% more damage is a win. Lucky. Yeah, we've got the bridge key by there. Almost definitely something that we would have needed going forward.
Oh, this gun is doing 60 damage now. I think it's doing about 40 odd before, isn't it? Oh. That is the first time I've ever had that weird noise that didn't result in my game crashing and turning off. Get some extra ammo and the like. Alright, fine. Skill points available. Leave me alone. I'm currently using a handgun, so we'll put some points into a handgun there. Put a few points into this. Into all of these, really. Sounds like there's those little, uh, yeah, those little guys. It's exactly what I thought it was. <laughs> okay, there is a robot over there. Like that. What oh, this is unlocked? Can we? No, oh, these just logs and stuff. All right, let's exit this. Can that help us? Oh damn! That's more like it. Yeah. I should get some damage around here. Well, these guys became way less intimidating. Uh, there we are. Can you hear me, Captain? I have successfully we go. integrated myself into the Hope's comm systems and am attempting Fantastic, to establish contact Ada. with the Hope's more primitive processor now. Oh, all right. Show me where I need to go, Ada, and I will get it done. Oh, we can open here. Mega Sprat. Oh, God. It's a shotgun. Where are these little sprats taking so many shots? Thankfully they don't do much damage. So it doesn't really matter. Ah! Oh, where'd he go? experience wow you shake your head at me young man okay that could have been a very sticky situation but we managed to get past it going for that I find myself glad to have no olfactory system Oh, there was explosives right here that I could have shot. Um, okay, this appears to have just been an optional area, which may have resulted in my death. Were I not amazing at games. Oh, 
What's the armor rating on this? 38. This is 39. Heavy ranged weapon skills. Yeah. We need to go mad with getting rid of stuff. Yeah, if things look like they're gonna get too difficult and I risk dying, I'm gonna run back or fast travel back to my ship so that I can save and then just have to run through the area again. So far, I don't think I need to risk going back to uh, to heal just yet. These were the private quarters of the Hope's former crew. Shall we hold a moment of silence for the dearly departed? No. That's odd, oh, because my programming would indicate that when forced to confront the idea of self-death, organics prefer... Oh, I see. Yes, never mind. I know when you fight against the board, you have a, a final boss of sorts in this game. Uh, this robot you have to fight. So obviously I'm not going to have to fight that this time. But then I didn't have to fight it on the hope, I don't think. No, I didn't. I didn't have to fight it on the hope. That's the hope's computer up ahead. I'll admit. I am curious to wake him. Comms. Tell you what. Can I just fast travel back to the ship from here? No, the game will not let me fast travel back to the ship. Right, we've cleared out the way. So I'm going to run back to the ship because obviously skipping into the sun or whatever, if I manage to do it, will get me killed. But if the game doesn't actually count it as finishing the game, I'm going to die and I'm going to have to redo all this again, which I will not do, basically. <laughs> Although I know it'll be half as difficult since I'll know to pick up this bolt gun. This bolt rifle, whatever this weapon is called. I'll know to pick it up. And then I'll also know not to fight the, uh, the Sprat. Or the Mega Sprat. But still, I, I don't want to risk it. Especially when I can run back here just for literally 40, 50 seconds. And save the game. Now yeah, look, got some energy ammo that we nearly missed out on. You see, it was worth it. It was the right thing to do. And you know, if you're doing the same thing, I would either recommend waiting until I do it just to make sure that you don't die and you haven't got to do it again, or do it as I have done and run back to save the game first. Since if this works. We will get a uh, end game credit, and we'll get the achievement for finishing the game on Supernova. If we don't get the achievement, then obviously we're going to keep playing. If we do get the achievement, though, and you would like me to continue and get the, I, I guess a more fit in end, then I shall. 
but only if you actually post you know in the comments that you'd like me to do that otherwise I will continue uh, consider my playthrough finished and then I won't you know I I'll be finished with this game. at least streaming it anyway I still got one more level to get on my normal playthrough. And I'm going to be playing it another time so I can get the achievement for collecting all of my companions. Since in my first playthrough I got every companion bar one. I'm really annoyed by that. <laughs> But when uh, that final playthrough comes about, it's going to be a, just a chill to play through. I'll pr I might even play it on easy just so, because the whole point of it is just to have fun and just mop up the stuff. It may not go on easy. It may just do normal like I did my first playthrough. Don't want it to be in, you know. Don't want it to be ridiculously easy with no challenge. Oh yeah, I'm not allowed to throw this way, am I? Which way did I come? What's this? A shock cannon? Sweet. I'll take it. Ah yeah, here we go, here we go. Right. Elevator here. Need to do something. Oh, yeah, I was going to drink some water so my character's uh, first meter doesn't drop too low. You know, just in case. A whole heap in of just in case this, this, this. Yeah. Uh, comms, patch Ada through. I'm speaking to you through the Hope's computer system. It's a rather cruel so feeling, but it'll do. Yeah. Are you sure? That is extremely dangerous. Skipping the hope will void the warranty on the skip drive. <laughs> and also potentially kill an entire planet. How is my humor now, Captain? Improved? Oh, very, very improved. Jump starting the skip drive. Destination set to Tartarus. I'm skipping it myself. I advise that, Captain. Can I just get I off it? Does your captain seriously intend to do a micro? Yeah. Right, let's um. Oh damn! I've skipped it because I wanted to reload and. Attempt that again, but uh, all right. Okay, cool. We can skip this cutscene, so I can reload it and try that again. All right. Successfully skip. Have I got? Oh no, I haven't got skill points available. How close am I to sixty-five science? Very far. So I just skip that cutscene for nothing. Ah, oh, oh, doesn't matter. I believe they're eager to speak with you once you've returned to the ship. Oh well, I suppose that's what I'll be doing for my final, my third playthrough that I'll be doing off camera. Make my character super stupid and blow up myself. There's a speedrun of a guy who finishes the game in 13 minutes, so worst case, I'll just watch his speedrun, because he uh, finishes the game by blowing himself up. And the game devs, or at least one of them who watched the video, uh, it was an IGN video that I seen, they, you know, their uh, response was not to discredit his playthrough, because it is like, fantastic what he's done, but they would like to see how fast someone could do it on... Uh, getting the you know the the full ending or 
play, doing a playthrough or a speedrun of the full game, not just blowing themselves up. Although they did agree it is technically a valid end game, or way to finish the game, you do technically get an ending. I get the feeling maybe I should have tried clicking A on the, uh, uh, what's it called, the crossed out, the locked option. I didn't even press A on it. Attention, All right, lay it on me. Of the unreliable. This is Chairman Rockwell. I'm on Tartarus oh, wow. and... Oh, Chairman. Uh, we need your help. What's up? Thanks to your intelligence, we successfully captured Phineas, but he's... Well, he somehow turned the tables on us. A <laughs> crackpot scientist has caused a riot among the prisoners and unpaid laborers. It's a law damned bloodbath down here. As unpaid if that were enough, laborers. he's gone and taken Sophia hostage. I'm not gonna mince words. The situation is dire. We... I... need your help. I'm on my Make way. Haste, Captain. We're losing men by the... Oh, fuck. Fuck! They're at the door! I need to hide! Hurry! <laughs> Alright then, to Tartarus. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, see, so this is the end game. Which, to be fair, them saying that they'd like to see how... Oh shit, I saved over it. I wanted to go... Ah, damn it, I'll have to... Ah, oh, it doesn't matter, I just want to go through the game again anyway. Oh, I just did. Right. Captain, I am pleased to inform you that we have successfully landed on Tartarus. Please well, be advised good, that electrical good. storms on the surface of Tartarus so, well, make quickly, departure um, impossible at this time. Right. Tartarus. Uh, know anything useful about Tartarus. Resident count is as follows. 3,071. Resident deaths, including but not limited to executions, are as follows. Executions? Resident escapes are as follows. Zero. The interior can be changed. Oh, damn. Take a scarf with you, Captain. I would also ask <laughs> that you leave your Captain's ID with me. Thanks. In the event that you do not return. I can make the assurance that I will not leave with another captain unless you do not return within 876,541,652 hours. Oh, speak of the devil. Captain, I am receiving a transmission from the prison's docking authority now. You're the backup, right? Uh -huh. From Akande? Thank the law you're here. These bloodthirsty sprat bags have no respect for the law. We're pinned down. Sprat bags. Alright, I'm coming, lads. <gasps> I don't understand either. It's not like I tortured them or anything. That was somebody else's job. You've got to help us. Please, <laughs> kill them. Summary justice for the whole lot. Sh sure thing. I'll handle it, but I need a prisoner. Bust through. Are you out of your mind? Those animals will tear us apart. No, oh, mate. Trust me. Persuade Ferdy. Get out of there and make UDL proud. Do it for the chairman! Oh, law. You're right. Okay. Come on, guys. Rifles up. Let's kick these wrong leeches out of our docking bay. For the chairman! Tartarus yeah! Hang on. Is that another ship coming in? I think that's from the Groundbreaker. Cripes, did that Tennyson woman really send reinforcements? Between you and the Mardettes, we may be able to retake the docks. Good luck out there, Captain. Transmission terminated. How can I be of assistance? Uh, Goodbye. Uh, end conversation. Goodbye. Right. Can I save the game by here? Cool.
point of no return. Let's do a new save right here then. Just to be safe. Well, I suppose I would have just got uh, an auto save, but yeah, it's fine. It is fine. Just realized I probably should have had. Um, A board on my thing, so you know people know this is a board playthrough, not a I don't know, Phineas playthrough, I suppose. But, you know, like the board, not uh, board. The captain did right that? by us once. Now it's time. Forward for groundbreaker. Right. If I'm lucky, I can just hang back and let these guys kill everything. Cause I've done it before where I accidentally shot at them and they will all turn on you, you know, as you would expect when someone shoots you in the back basically. Uh, come on, lads. Oh. So, yeah, they took that out. They cleared that out easily. The bad news is, I think there's going to be a final boss. It was a giant robot last time, which spawned smaller robots. Well, not giant, but big robots that spawned smaller robots. It was quite difficult. I think that this could possibly have the same boss fight. But I'm not going to rule out the possibility that I'm going to have to fight a giant robot. What the? Fuck. Hmm. Alright, let's, um, let's load. I'll quickly sleep in my bed before I leave the leave the ship, maybe it'll give me my health back. Oh, see this loaded screen is so annoying. It takes too long. I'll save you, Chairman Rose. Ah, oh, sweet, we get our health back. Period of unconsciousness. <laughs> I think yeah. I'll yes, it is, Ada. Alright, um... So, your crap. Um, oh, well, it could be good, you never know. Shock cannon. Heavy... Nothing. Energy. Energy. Initiate an unscheduled rest cycle while you're out. Yeah, yeah, you you do that, Ada. You do that. Meanwhile, because I don't know how strong the melee weapons are. Is I don't remember. I did know at one point because I went on a massacre around the ground breaker, killing people with. Um, Oh, there's an achievement for it for beating them with the, the, kind of like the baseball bat like weapon. They got that sport in this game, haven't they? It's like it's like a bat with a sort of net on the end of it. Yeah, for the captain. That's me. Yeah, so even though we don't get any experience of doing this, we are safe right now. Oh, 
Do we have alternatives? Yes, here we go. Few hits to be sure. Just me, don't worry. All right. I'm going to go to stealth mode. Try and just kill people with some stealth and activate in uh, time dilation. So that's really though, isn't it? Everyone knows it. There we go. Yeah, this gun is so strong. The only downside is the charge up required before you're allowed to shoot. If I recall correctly. No, see, last time I had loads of support that helped basically everyone. There we go. Couldn't see where the bloody fool was. Who shot me? <laughs> That's bullshit. You know, you can't shoot through a fucking train, man. What was that about? Considering doing a playthrough for Nia soon, uh, the Xbox 360 Nia, I finally managed to track it down again. Well, uh, not again. Well, yeah, again. Uh, no, see, it didn't even flip and save when I healed. So this game, childish ass that it is. doesn't even re-save when you re you know like you know when you come back here and re-leave yeah, it just has that one save and I'm not falling for that again so I'm not gonna change my weapon and sleep every bloody time but yeah considering doing a playthrough for Nia it'll, it'll depend on how things go if I do start streaming a bit more frequently, what with the uh, the whole uh, virus nonsense at the moment, well not really nonsense, but you know, the whole virus scare at the moment, people self-isolating and everything. To be fair, I spend a lot of time at home anyway, so I don't see why it would make me stream more, since not really much you can do when you're disabled. The captain did right by <laughs> You know, I'm legally blind and such. One of my partner's in university, so weren't really swimming. I, don't know, I was, I was had a lot of free time, but not really. Oh, he's just not doing it. Oh. Cr 
critical hit, Biatch. Honestly, I'm, next time I die, I'm considering just letting these guys clear out that first room, going back and saving, just so at minimum I don't have to do that first room over and over again. I'm going to try using the pistol again over the gun, since the pistol fires much faster and does a double shot. Although it's not as strong. I think that was actually a bit easier. Yeah, so if you have other groups of people on your side, they'll actually come to help you at this point. That's why uh, when I said, uh, if I remember correctly, what I was referring to was at that point, last time. Whoa! Oh, fucker! That was... That's what killed me last time as well, isn't it? <sighs> That's why I died. I didn't know there was someone on the fucking right side. If I do get far into this though, I am strongly likely, I guess, like, you know, it's very, very likely that I'm going to run all the way back just to save. And I say if I get far, I mean, if I clear out that second room, I'm going to run back and save. And I'm just going to have to do it like that, every one or two rooms just run back. I won't do it for the first room, since the AI cleared it out for me. To be fair, so is it's two loading screens just for the sake of it. If I do it for the first room, open fire! Open fire! For the ground breaker. That's interesting. You don't get any experience for injuring someone who then dies. You have to have the killing blow by the looks of it. By that logic, it would also imply that it doesn't matter how much damage you deal to them. As long as you get the death blow, you get the experience. These guys are killing these fools. Oh, wait, you wait. I think they might be in a. Yeah, they were a prisoner. The vermin. I like how these prisoners, none of them have that assault rifle ultra. Oh, there we are. Good. I was about to say then, because it seems as if the game just fought right. Now that you're on your own, now we'll give them the strong guns. Right, come on, let's let's clear out this second room, shall we? See, I'm going to use the assault rifle ultra, at least for the first two guys. If it seems to be weaker. Well, not not weaker, because obviously it will do less damage than the um, the plasma carbine, not plasma blaster, not blaster, whatever it was, plasma something, plasma rifle maybe. It'll obviously do less damage, but we're looking for more for. Um you know, just how quickly it can kill them, not necessarily.
not necessarily how much damage it does, how quickly it can kill them, was what I was going to say. Before I got charged by a guy with a fucking shock cannon, which killed me instantly, and I had full health. This is why the not being able to save on this difficulty is stupid. It's it's not balanced. I know I'm at the end of the game, so clearly it's doable. And let, let's check the rarity of this supernova achievement. 0.33%. It's not really common, is it? To be fair. I was hoping to finish the game in this stream, and I don't know if I'll be able to. Is the honest, uh, honest truth there? I want. I only wanted to stream for an hour and a half, and I'm already over an hour and fifteen. So I'll go up to two hours at the very most. If I'm still on this part by two hours, I'm gonna have to just call it quits for the day and accept that I won't be finishing it in this stream. I'm not going to do like I did with Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order and end up with a four and a half hour stream. Three hours on the final boss fight. I'm also not going to waste my time. Uh, you know, like I'm going to loot some people because they got stuff. I'm not going to save it right now, since my board reputation went down I hit someone on the board, which is potentially very bad. Like I said, I accidentally hurt people before and it resulted in them trying to kill I can't recall if it was just that one group of them or if it was every time that set of people spawned they also tried to kill me. I, I think it was the former. Just that one group of them wanted me dead. I got health regeneration. I didn't realize that. Reloading now. Aha! Probably the geezer who's killed me every time. Yeah, I kept shooting because I kind of thought he was just going to move. <laughs> I really didn't think he was going to just stay there. I still got the effect of these N rays on me. Never move, I, I appear to have a purple outline. A pinky purple outline. Now which way are you going for? Alright, alright. No, stay away! Whatever that is, I don't want anything to do with it. Let's make sure there's no one coming around to shoot me in the ass again. No. Ok. 
Okay, this room is clear. I know what I said. I'm not gonna... I don't think this will be a checkpoint. But I, I might, if I'm lucky, I might get a quick at this point. That's the thing, you know, if there are quick saves, then this process becomes marginally easier. Substantially easier. If the game wants me to go through it all in one fell swoop, potentially fight a final boss without dying, or having to backtrack, you know, because if I had to go backtrack through this all the time and then run across it and get a loading screen, that's going to be just not nice, not fun. And yeah. There has not been a, a save. Uh, what's it called? There was no auto save. Let's have a look. Can we see anyone? Yeah. Oh, I haven't even taken damage. I just assumed I had. Why is it on fucking settings all the time? Yeah, I don't care. This is going to be long. I'm going to, like I said, the first uh, just just now. When I kill everyone in that room, I'm running back. I'm going back to the ship. Oh, there was a save. Oh, thank God for that. All right. Well, I'm not. I'm not annoyed anymore. All right. It's all good. I still hate the game for putting the checkpoints before you travel and not after. But I suppose that's in the interest of safety, in case you fast travel into not fast travel, you load an area and you instantly die. That way. You know, you, you don't have to worry about infinite death loops, perhaps? Ha, I got the drone that time. Or this time.
who's shooting me? I don't get it. Why am I... Why am I on settings, for one? Will you just please not put me on settings, for fuck's sake? I, obviously, I, I know why they're doing it. You died. Yes, I know I died. I'm on the hardest difficulty in the game. And it is not an easy difficulty, just because of how... Shit. The character, the player character is, you know, in comparison. He dies way, or she dies way too easily. Do not get me started on these loading screens. Let's quickly count out roughly how long. So say six, seven. Yeah, we say he was on forty-five when it started. It says ten seconds. Twenty. Yeah, approximately twenty three seconds per loading screen. Oh, he's alive. Oh, I fucked it this time, have I? <sighs> I I don't even know what to do. I didn't go down twice. So every time I die, I got about a minute of loading screens. No wonder I'm losing my hour and a half, well, like, you know, my half an hour so fast. Absolute pain in the anus. I'm definitely going to have to go up to two hours because otherwise I'm going to end up having an hour and a half which is ending in a minute and the final half an hour of the video is going to be about five to ten minutes of load times. I don't, I don't feel comfortable doing that. You know, I need a bit more substance. Substance, a bit more gameplay. Substance, sustenance. Alright, let's have a look. Can I just sneak around? Yeah, if my lockpicking wasn't so low for some reason. Look, my lockpick is 62. Why is it dropped so low? Is it the armour? No, why is my lockpicking dropped so much? So, alright, being first, he drops everything. Alright, let's have a look then. If I drink a drink. Anyway, I don't know what that does. No. Glacier water. There we are. There we go. There we are, my lock picking is back up. Access storage. There we are, got some stuff here. Got the two mag locks back. 
Close the door just in case. Someone went on alert for a second there, but it was nothing to worry about. There we go. So we got rid of these. We got rid of two people. They have not been spotted. Right, you fool. Oh god. Ah! Alright. We got them this time. Let's collect all their jargon here. They won't be needing it. One more. Yeah, god, we take this old rifle off. Oh, won't ya? Take me home, sing it, do 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 Okay, we got them. We somehow managed to clear them out. Yeah, the best best uh, thing to do here is to not push our luck and try to go around the long ways and clear out everything. The, the only sensible option I have is to go for the quick routes. Well, I flobbed that up, didn't I? And not get everyone's attention is what I was going to say. And then I went and got everyone's attention. So I've effectively died this time. I shoot the explosive tank. I should have just crouched and hit, like sneaked past. And the problem is now I'm probably not going to be able to kill those first four or five guys as comfortably as I just did.
Not to mention having to do this bollocks every time now. I'm going to have to go here and drink some glacial water. Especially, I, I don't know, I just really don't like how the game doesn't sort of remember, or like, not doesn't recheck point. It's really interesting though how killing, shooting the sentry or the medical drone always gets people's attention, whereas killing a human doesn't. Or shooting at a human doesn't get everyone's attention. It's really weird. I might try the approach of just running past everything. Like, not literally running past everything, but try and only fight what I need to. There, look, see? Shot him, didn't die, but he didn't alert everyone. Why the hell did they see me? I was hid behind those boxes initially, anyway, before I like came out to shoot, uh, well, before I ran away. Why are they not dying? That was fucking bullshit. Why didn't they die? I hit them like three times, man. Oh, it was probably the fucking drone again, wasn't it? Healing him. Or healing her, I think it was. Fucking cunt, man. <sighs> Honestly, I fucking hate this. Every time, tell you what, I'm not even gonna kill. I'm just gonna kill that one guy on the left and see if I can just sneak onto the elevator and go up. Because if I don't have to kill everyone, then I'm not going to. According to the Xbox Marketplace, this game is considered as a stealth game anyway. There's no definitive stealth options. You know, I can't just stealthily execute someone. One click too many. Right, give me my pancake mix, damn it.
Well, it worked. All right, I'll just do that every time. Security patrol initiated. Threat level elevated. Let's go back here for a second. What was that? Nothing. Alright, I, I got lucky there. I got very lucky. Oh, really? I think I may have found an alternate way up there. So we need to be. Oh, okay. I was going to say then, why let me go this way?
Why didn't I look? That could have easily been avoided if I didn't shoot the first guy without realising there was a fucking second one. I thought there was just the one and the other one was in a different room. I could have just walked fucking right past. See, this is what annoys me. It's just this. Having to do this fucking trivial shit every time. Can't you just remember? Can't you just remember that I drank the free drinks and just put me on the other side of the fucking door? Every time. It's just a waste of a minute, man. Every death is just a waste is what pisses me off as well. Ten minutes, basically. Ten minutes, which meant nothing. Other than the obvious, oh, well, now I know I can climb up the thing. Well, yeah, I got, I got that, in theory, so I can go a little bit faster this time. mean to do that. Meant to do that. Medical drone is fast. There we go. Not quite as fast as I had hoped. Since I got the attention of the captain as well. Uh, at least it was just the captain, eh? I'm glad that these people ignore the fact that gunshots go off every now and again. Pick it up, man! Goodness me.
what? Are you serious? I'm dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me close the door this time, please. Thank you. That's one thing to bear in mind. Even if I say I'm dead, I'll still attempt to... Oh, there was a fucking stealthy way by here. I'll still attempt to not be dead. that? Nothing. What was that? Nothing. Get him! All right. I'm not going to complain to a guy who just suddenly Stop trying to kill me. Unseal the door. Chairman? Oh! Alright, well I didn't expect him to be dead. If you um, side against the board, he's actually not dead. You can kill him if you choose, but you have the choice. But now that I've chosen to be kind of bad, I suppose, the game removes away your choice to kill him or not. Since obviously, I guess the game assumes you're not going to kill him. Why would you? You're on his side. Medical drawn. Alright. So we gotta get into the middle. both out and no one cares despite the fact there was an explosion as well <laughs> you won't hear any complaints from me that's for sure oh sugar okay okay there's a 
four people over there. Another four dead and also people didn't care. Oh, there was explosive barrels I got shot by there. Haha. <laughs> Pretty sure I also have not had a checkpoint again. When I pulled you out of the hope, oh. I never imagined you'd turn me over to the board. Planting a bug in my terminal? That's low. Oh. We could have saved Sorry. this colony, you know. That was always the plan. I revive you, you do as I say. I tell you to go there, get me this, shoot that, and you do as I say. If you just listened huh. to me, we could have rescued everyone on the Hope. We could have been the saviors of Halcyon. But you didn't listen. No one in this damn colony ever listens. Well, you sound like a bit of a slave driver. Ha! No, of course not. You're the board's lackey now. Yeah, that's right. And isn't that just pay? No dividends? one's lackey. The thought of someone as brilliant as you working for that miserable gang of odious bureaucrats. Merciful law. It's downright unfair. What did they tempt you with, hmm? Power? Money? One of those fancy reclining chairs? <laughs> the reclining chair. Of course you do. You and your iron will. You've always been driven by powerful convictions. Once you set your mind to something, you are impervious to arguments. This is how the board operates. It's not enough that they should win. They must see me fail. Well, I haven't failed, do you hear me? I still have one last gamut. No? I've got Adjutant Akande here with me, and I'm going to put a bullet through her eye. Which one? I can't imagine we've got anything left to say. No, we, no, we do. We do. Damn it. Yes, I expect we are. I've programmed the Labyrinth <sighs> Mechanical Warden to kill you on sight. I'm sorry to have to do this, but I can't take any chances with you. You were my greatest success. And my greatest disappointment. Great, I still have to fight the fucking... Oh, it wasn't a giant robot, it was just a robot. The game's not going to give me a chance. Yeah, six minutes. That's So if I die, I won't be uh, attempting it again in this video. I'm just going to have to call it quits for today, since we're on two minutes now. Uh, two hours now. didn't know the door sealed. I'm going to click continue just to see where it puts me. If I'm close, I will attempt it again.
If not, then I'm like I said, I'm going to call it quits for the day. Which is annoying, because that is the final boss. But the problem is, there's, just, there's too much. There's way too much, like, trekking to do if I'm back at that door, at the very... Yeah. <sighs> no, I, I, I don't want to. I, I don't even want to. That's the problem. Like, you know, it's all well and good putting a fucking checkpoint by here. But th this isn't even close. This is less than halfway through the fucker. Got to climb up, all the way up it. So yeah, um, I guess I'm gonna have one more stream where I'll hopefully, f hopefully finish it. I might look online just to see if there's any strategies for beating that boss on the hardest difficulty. Well, that being said, I probably let's check something. What's my persuade? What's my science? I see my science is nowhere near high enough. Uh, and if I boost my persuade up and then put on I haven't got it with me anymore. I don't even know. Well, I I'll have to boost my persuade and hopefully I'll be able to talk my way out of it with um with Phineas. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave a like if you have and consider subscribing to the channel. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, please like and subscribe. And uh, what's it called? My Twitch is the Cosmic Turtles, one word, and my YouTube is the Cosmic Turtle, three separate words. So if you're on one, please check out the other. I've got tons of videos on YouTube, and I stream every day on Twitch between five and eight o'clock for about two hours. Um, I normally only do the weekdays, but I'm probably going to start doing the weekends. Um, in the near future, because I think you know it's just more convenient for people to watch on a weekend and a weekday anyway. So yeah, take care and have a great day. Bye now.